All right. It's a little tour of my tiny apartment. It's empty. But uh, I put my futon together. Got it set up here, so it's a little bit smaller. It's got laminate floor instead of carpet, like my other one had. Yeah, it's got the stove and the refrigerator, and the kitchen's a lot smaller. But I think that's all gonna be all right. The bathroom. I could turn on the lights because it's still got power under the landlord's name, but I won't. But it's just a small bathroom. It's just got a bathtub and it's got one of those shower spouts that you can unlatch. So that's cool because my other one didn't have that. It's kind of nice. It's got something that somebody markered on the mirror, I guess. Some people that stay in these apartments aren't so great, but... What's up, Brian? Showing off the new apartment, but there's not much to show, really. It's just small. This window's got the worst view. It's just kind of the side of another building. But this is a good thing. Got a washer and dryer. They're old, kind of small. It's really small, but it'll work. So this room will be the office room. Well, I have all my bookshelves and the whiteboard. I we'll probably have to go there. It kind of sucks like when you're moving or you're considering a place, you have to consider like where all the outlets are, like where all the you know furnaces are, like where the windows are, where the doors are. Ryan, <laughs> I got my futon together already. Yeah. It's not bad. I mean, I'm making like 400 a week now, so. This view is a little better, but then the other side of the building is really better. But you can see that there's multiple buildings out here like this. So, that's my vehicle down there. It's got an air conditioner in here for when it starts getting warmer, so that's nice. This will be the bedroom. It's smaller. I got a queen size bed, so I don't know. I'm thinking it's going to have to go there on that side with the window because I'm going to want my TV in here. It's going to have to go there because there's a register there. Can't really do a whole lot there in the closet there. So it's going to be way more cramped in here. In my bedroom, but that's fine. The good thing about this is I can play the PlayStation VR out here and have plenty of room. To back up and the tracking and everything will be great so but it'll still be a little clustered but the view out here is nicer it's a cracked window yeah I guess some of the previous tenants aren't really too smart I don't know they messed up this door too but I said I can just put posters and stuff on it but you know that looks pretty nasty but that's fine. I'll just cover it up. There's probably some of the worst stuff in here. There's one on the bathroom door. It said if you put a little mirror over the hole, somebody punched. What's up, Brittany? You got a new apartment. You put that there to cover up a hole, I guess. It's kind of weird, so. I don't know. But it's not bad. The cabinets look all really clean and everything, and pretty nice. So, fire extinguisher, fire alarm. This will have to do, I guess. I gotta get the electricity and the water and stuff turned on tomorrow. I'll try to get my internet hooked up here. But, I don't know if the fridge isn't probably as nice as what I had, but it's not bad, I guess. I don't know. Well, there's not really much else to show because it's pretty empty. But I'm really glad to have a washer and dryer. This is an upstairs apartment, so I got people below me. 
my amp. And the cool thing is I'm gonna have all my all my retro games out here. I'm gonna have the my regular big screen TV and my um, whatever you call those old TVs, CRT or whatever, to play the light gun games. I'm gonna have like two TVs over there. Everything's gonna be out here. So I'm gonna make this like a game room, maybe. <laughs> My living room will be a game room. So, well, I'm gonna head back to my apartment, the apartment I'm staying in. So that's it.